yes so there should be chess okay so it is a good sport yes tell me my name is anju uh, i'm from mumbai excuse you for what my dear um nothing sorry <laughs> so my name is darsh and i uh, right. i okay. am currently Your living name? i'm currently living in nasik and uh, i am studying in ryan international school i am currently in 7th grade and my hobby is to play badminton play cricket play no sorry not cricket play badminton football and basketball so these are my hobbies oh. and the most creative hobby of mine is to draw so i draw a lot and yes these are my hobbies and i my self what i what is it that you draw i drew what uh, is it that you like to draw you said drawing oh. is one of your hobbies right oh so i like to do fri- fictional characters which i imagine and i like to draw them oh so yes So, uh, Darsh, did you check the topic for the day? Yes, I did. And today's topic is sports. Very interesting topic. Yes. So, any specific sport? Now you told me about three, four games, like whatever you play. Any specific sport that you like to play? Badminton. Ah, uh, my specific sport. Badminton. I like to play badminton. Okay. When was the first time when you played badminton? My first time playing badminton was when I was like four year old because I was not starting. But the first time I played with uh, was with my parents, and yes, it was fun. So from that age, after like after two years, I started like. learning about gathering things so matlab when i was in first grade i started like learning about badminton and how how are the rules so i made a little ground near my uncle's house and yes that house uh, my uncle shifted from there and what happened they had a pretty large ground which was com- uh, which they had a garage on so he, they took the garage and the ground was empty so what i did with my they friend they took the garage yes they took the garage they like uh, uh unas- unassembled it and then they like uh, put it in a truck and the truck went so it was kind of like that so where they shifted so they shifted okay. in goa okay so you mean the things that were kept there in yes. the garage yes. they packed everything and they took okay no the garage uh, they took the garage itself also like okay. the material used to build the garage like the steel like steel okay. roof so they uprooted everything and then they packed it and then yes okay all right fine so yeah. that ground was empty so i what i did with my friend is like uh, i started cleaning that ground with a broom and yes it took me like a whole three days to clean it because it was very messy and we start what we did that we had a black wire which was like of no use so what we did that we took that wire and placed it and a pole so what we did that we uh, we we took the wire we rolled it around the tree many times then we took the wire from the tree to the pole and we rolled it on the pole so the, it was tight and so what we did uh, my friend and i took a cot and uh, we placed the cot just beside the ground so everyone which is sitting outside to see us can sit there or sit there for their turn so what we did i uh, my friend 
uh, like started the badminton journey and like from there onward we started playing on the court in the court and after from there we also participated in many competition i i went to quarter finals but uh, sadly did not win anything and my friend went to semi finals and the person who beat uh, uh, the and he also lost and then we don't we didn't get anything but he got the second trophy and yes we were happy from our journey and this was the journey of my badminton so and you said apart from badminton it is basketball that you like to play play football 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 okay all right so when did you realize that you like playing football so there was a when corona came that we were we were like not able to play badminton because the court was mostly closed because of the virus and so what we started doing that we started playing in the ground uh, the ground the property of the company we started playing over there it was a empty ground with a park just next to it so we started playing in it so what what the children saw which were playing on the pa- in the park that we are playing football so a, a lot of children came to us and asked asked us that can we can we play with you so lot of students started coming and playing with us st- started playing with us so there uh, we are uh, we were total six boys who were start who started playing and slowly slowly more children came and we started playing with them and now there is like 20 students maximum 20, 20 children who ke- come to 20 children. 20 children who come to that park daily and play football over there so that how uh, that was the uh, that was the journey of my football when i started playing football so so, so you all have uh, a team with you or you all come together and play with each other no 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 we just came together and played so do so you like any sport no my dear i don't like any sport so you don't go outside or do walking or something not like that So do you do any job? <laughs> This is my job. Uh, uh, I am a teacher. Except clapping go. No, this is my job. Okay, so. All right. So tell me which qualities a sports person should have. Should have. Hmm. Qualities a sport sports person should have. Hmm. So you had a journey of badminton. You had a journey of football. So I'm sure you must know the qualities. So it depends on which kind of sport the person is playing. Like I can't can't tell him that he is playing badminton. Then there are different personalities that he should have to play a, a become a good badminton player or. A, he is playing he is playing as a footballer then he should have different personality to become a good footballer so it depends on him that which sport he playing is he playing okay what are the qualities that every sports person whether he is a cricketer or a badminton player or a table tennis player or a football player or a basketball player or a rugby player should have in common Uh, but i have no idea about okay. that patience patience is yes. and um, kindness maybe yes. so to let your opponent take the chance not always 
whenever required. Patience, kindness, and anything and else. Uh, sportsmanship. Yes. See, now you told me I don't know. <laughs> yeah, you should always think. You should not easily give up. Always think. And good personality, positive attitude. Yeah. Good person. Yes. All right. And uh, should be able to take feedback in a positive manner, yes. so that they can grow. Yes. So they can grow and move forward. Perform well. Yeah. Move ahead. Okay. So tell me, which are the sports you think? Should be compulsory in school. In school, yes. Mm -hmm. So there should be chess. Okay, so it is a good sport. Chess is a very good sport, and badminton, uh, basketball, football, and like and carom. And uh, hockey should be there because it is our national game. Hockey should be there, and cricket should be there. Cricket is a very popular game in India, so cricket should be there. Hockey should be there. Football, basketball, chess, carom, and I think there should be. Kabaddi, yes, Kabaddi, and yes, Kabaddi ra uh, race practice, and many other sports aside, which should be compul, which should be compulsory in the school, because a school can't teach every sport. So you should go in a in a particular coaching to practice that particular sport. Like I went to a chess coaching one time, and from there, when I learned, and that was my starting of chess. And when I learned from it, I keep on, I kept on learning. And at my age was seven, and I held the second trophy in my city, hmm. second place, and on chess. Your city or, or uh, your town? Town, you can say town. And uh, any favorite sports personalities that you are fond of? You like to read about them. You like to know about them. Mm, sorry, what I didn't understand what you sports said. Sports personality. Your favorite sports personality. Personality. My favorite sports personality. Means like I'm not able sports to understand person. like how sports, sports person. person your favorite sports person. Um, maybe in badminton there is Lee Chong Wei, and in cricket there is a uh, uh, Dhoni. Sir, and in football there is Maradona, sir, and yes, in basketball there. Not my favorite. There is no player favorite. My favorite player in basketball, but these four the sports I have a favorite player: Maradona, uh, Dhoni sir, and Lee Chong Wei. That's it. Why do you like Dhoni? Because he's a good cricketer. He like, like, I like his six, like this when he just puts out a six. So the time is about to get over with. No, no, we still have time. Okay, if you want your feedback, then. Uh... I will give you a feedback. You have to practice more and more. Okay, and okay. you have to frame sentences using the correct 
verb form. Verb. Okay. Yeah. So when you were talking about the ground, that was of the past, right? Where you started practicing badminton with your friend. So you only you can simply frame sentences using simple past. You do not okay. have to uh, use past continuous in all the sentences. Not required. Okay. You can just frame sentences using simple past tense. That's it. Okay. All right. Take care. Bye. Okay. Bye. Bye.